David Judd rarely misses a spot when he's cleaning in the juvenile detention center. He's a custodian here, but he uses more than just mops and towels to brighten this place up. Painting is a runner, man. He uses paintbrush strokes as well. When it's finished, this painting will adorn a wall in the detention center's B-pod. The runner represents strength and the will to overcome adversity. I think we're all influenced by images and words and, you know, everything around us. I think uh, it has an impact. The story of how David Judd dedicates the full range of his talents to public service shows how Johnson County government puts the pillars of performance into action. It just feels natural to me. It doesn't, it, I mean, it feels like I'm working, but yet I'm not really working. It doesn't feel like work because David is doing something he loves. He's been painting since the age of four and was a student at the Colorado Art Institute. After he joined county government, he submitted a painting to the Arts KC auction. His co-workers took notice. His talent kind of speaks for itself if you look around. He's got an imagination and it comes through in his artwork. It's very unique. It's kind of got a little bit of fantasy feel to it, but it's real. His supervisor, Jody Taylor, then asked him to paint a mural for this room at the Adolescent Center for Treatment. Everyone liked it so much, it led to more requests for David to paint more murals. He still works his day job and paints when he comes home to his studio. So far, David has painted 11 murals for three different corrections facilities. It's art that inspires. That's what I paint for, to improve people's lives, their perspectives, their perception. He wants the clients in these facilities to change their perception about their future when they see these murals. By inspiring hope and belief while pursuing his passion, David Judd and his murals are a pillars of performance success story showing Johnson County values at work.